All right, so in this video, we're gonna show you how to get some live data from your wheel speed sensors or your ABS sensors uh, from a, this is a Land Rover Discovery that we're in, but the process is really the same for any Land Rover or Jaguar vehicle. We're using the iCarsoft LR version 3.0, uh, which is available via the link in the description below this video. So as you can see, we've got the ABS warning lights and traction warning lights. I'm gonna click into diagnostics and just go through the process of selecting our vehicle first of all. That's a Discovery, Discovery 3, P6. Click OK to that. Then we're going to click on to Control Unit. So we want to try and find the ABS system. Sometimes it's listed as ABS. In this vehicle, it's listed as VDM, Vehicle Dynamics Control Module. Let's click OK to that. And then what you can do is if you want to read the fault code, click on to read the fault code, and it will give you see this is the fault that we're getting here front right wheel speed sensor circuit um, you don't have to rely on that what you can do is look at the live data so if you go to view data and there are lots of different uh, data sets that you can select from the ABS system but we're going to select the uh, the speed for each sensor so what it's what it's measuring for each sensor so we're going to click on to front left wheel speed sensor circuit input so we're going to do that for all of these sensors so that's the front left the front right, rear left, and rear right. Okay, so we're done with that, and we'll select F1, done. So now what this is going to do is it's going to give us the speed of all of the, um, the ABS sensors, depending on what the sensors are telling us from the rotation of the wheels. So I'm on private land here, and we're just going to do a quick movement. And what we'll do is we'll probably see it's the front right that we have a problem with. So we'll probably see this stay as zero, and the other three will probably start showing value. So I'll try and get this. In fact, what I'll do is I'll just try and get that close to the, uh, the camera as I'm moving here. So here we go. And there we go, that's exactly what I thought would happen. We are now seeing values from all of the other sensors apart from the sensor that we believe to be faulty and we know is faulty. So that is just a quick demonstration. I'm just gonna pull over again here, stop the vehicle. So that is a quick demonstration of how to get live ABS sensor data from the iCarsoft LR version 3.0. Uh, if you are interested in this tool, as I say, just click the link in the description below this video. And it obviously all it covers all of the systems as well in the vehicle. It does live data for all of the systems. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Sorry about the sun glare.